Welcome to the David Mayhew Photography Artist Studio, which is my basement, but don't tell anyone. No one will know. So basically, since we can't kick COVID to the curb, I can't do art fairs. I can't come to you, and I'm pretty sure you don't want to come all the way to Colorado to see me. So let's meet in the middle on the internet here and see if we can figure this thing out. Since I'm not traveling, I don't have the costs of hotel, uh, the, the show fees, and I don't have to sit up in the heat and humidity, which is really nice to sit here and just relax and do this. So I'm doing 20% off everything that's on display. Basically this stuff has been ready for the art fairs uh, for the beginning of the year and it's just been sitting in boxes here at home. So uh, I figured I'd put it up and show you what I got. Uh, later this weekend, uh, I'll be doing some, some live sessions. I'll be doing a Zoom uh, gathering with everyone who's on my e-list, my e-newsletter. Um, so the Zoom uh, chats, basically have a drink with the artist kind of thing um, will be today Friday and then on Saturday and Sunday I'll do a couple of live Facebook feeds uh, at different times so I'm going to have those posted hopefully with this video somewhere down below so you can see it uh, during the weekend I'll talk about different sizes different finishes and the different pieces the, the sort of storm chasing that I have to do to get these images I, I call my body of work skyscapes instead of landscapes as you can see I focus on the sky um, so I just want to give you insights into stories behind each image, well not each of them because I've got a lot here, but uh, some of those in a little more detail during the weekend. If you ever have any questions, feel free to give me a call. My phone number is 970-290-7987. Send me a text if you can just to make sure I'm available and not doing anything like this video um, so I can actually talk to you. Uh, and I do take sales over the phone if you're interested in getting one of these pieces. All right, let me give you the grand tour, starting with these big pieces back here. So this is uh, this one's a triptych called Forces of Nature. It's eight foot long, so it's actually 96 by 54, no, 96 by 64 inches in overall dimensions, set into the three sections. This was a storm up in Nebraska. And these are all on my infused aluminum, which really pops the vibrancy, which works so well for my work, gives that feeling of depth. Uh, then I've got a panoramic of Denver down the bottom, a 60 inch, two 40 by 60s. These two are really popular sellers. These are all limited editions to 30. Each five that sell, the price actually goes up on them. So for me to be knocking off 20%, these have never been on sale before uh, and probably never go on sale again. So if you're liking these ones, now's a good chance to, to buy them. Uh, two 32 by 48s to Lake Arena Night Skies and Supercell. But let me bring you in and show you closer detail of all of the things I have. So yes, here's a closer look at some of these guys. There's the Denver Sunrise, Fields of Glory and Supercell. And even Parallels and Lake Irene in Rocky Mountain National Park with the Milky Way there. Here's a list of some of the pricing and the pieces that we've got with the 20% off. So you can see the difference in pricing as they stand today. So the 60 by 20, the second one on the list is the Denver Sunrise. 40 by 60 is this size here. So down from 3365 to 2692 for this weekend. Anyway, and it is only the items I have in stock. So once they're gone, they're gone. Uh, another 40 by 60 here of static light and a couple of 28 by 42s Cadillac Ranch and Cloud of Witnesses down there and then on the back wall I have all my little guys so I have quite a few of these these ones were 320 and they're going for 256 256 for this weekend so I've got quite a few of those as I get by my um, elliptical which hasn't had a lot of use lately because we've been kind of busy uh, here's another wall with more of the small 12 by 18 so all the vertical ones are back here and a few additional ones down here hopefully I'm not running around too fast but I don't want this video to be too long either 24 by 36 is storm track and uneven parallels then out here we have a Slight change up with some of the pieces. Um, this here is my new finish called the hand etched metal. Basically, I grind the metal 
uh, and then put an epoxy coating on top. And this piece here is hullabaloo and it's my absolute favorite. It's just an abstract of clouds at sunset with a variety of colors. So as you move by, the different grinding from the metal picks up differently and changes the Im image. So it gives a dynamic feel to the pieces. So it's always eye-catching. I've done the same with uneven parallels over here where that graffiti and the sky has been ground. This one here is the strength within. And then I did Lake Irene as well. And on this one, I've used a different brush, different grinder on the sky, which kind of gives more of a sparkle effect to the sky than using the other grinder. And this one here is Storm Track. Two, three others that are done in the same style. There's Limbo. Here's Fields of Glory. And over there is Twist and Shout from a tornado. Then I have other pieces still on the infused aluminum here. Some 20 by 30s and 24 by 36s. Then I've got a few more stashed out back, including this one, which goes well with my shirt today. I don't get to wear my Hawaiian shirts much, but that's a Hawaiian sunset from the big island. Off the rails. Back here by the furnace. A few extra pieces. Again, I've got some in different sizes of uh, pieces that I have larger sizes up front. So there's Blood Moon, Aspiration. This one here is the lava fields of Hawaii with a tree growing out of the ashes. Boiling skies. And I've got a couple of panoramics. I actually didn't put the pricing of these up, so I have to figure those ones out. I've got 40 and 60 inches, no, 40 and 30 inches of both these two. Uh, True Grit and Serenity. And then here's a slightly different one, which actually is layered. So the islands kind of float off the background. So that one was 350, whatever the discount is from that. So that is my home studio tour. Hopefully you'll tune in and speak to me this weekend. I'm just happy to have a drink with some people. I've been so isolated that it's just nice to have some company. So that's my virtual art fair and hope to be speaking to some of you guys soon. All right, have a good weekend. Bye.